Hi, everybody. I am uh, Dr. Dheeraj K. Balaji, uh, Senior Consultant in Pediatric Surgery, Department of Pediatric Surgery at Astor RV Hospital. Uh, today, uh, I am going to talk on a small topic called hypospedias. Hypospedias uh, is uh, comparatively a rare condition. It is a unique uh, birth defect involving the baby's penile organ, wherein it is uh, present at birth. Hypospedias means that the opening of the urethral orifice is uh, not opening at the tip, it opens un at the under surface of the penis. It can be at various levels. It could be as low as possible or as very, it could be mild, moderate and severe. Mild means it is very distally placed, moderate in between and severe could be either in the scrotal area. Okay, and uh, this can, so as, as you know, the classification could be mild, moderate and severe. Hypospedias commonly associated with the forward curvature of the penis. That is called as caldi. It is more associated with moderate or severe cases. Okay, this hypospedias also can be associated with, uh, in severe cases can be associated with undescended testis or it can be associated with associated renal problems called as renal congenital anomalies. The common symptoms of hypospedias are basically uh, the urinary stream is not forward stream, it is abnormal stream going below. Secondly, if untreated, the hypospedias uh, persons cannot have a normal sexual activity because the opening is not normal and there could be a forward bend in the penile curvature. So the, there is, what is the treatment for hypospedias? The treatment for hypospedias is surgical repair. The timing of surgical repair being between 1 year to 18 months. Uh, how the penile organ is grown, depending on that, we decide. So this hypospedias can be done in single stage or in two stages. Single stage is advised for hypospedias, whereas it is mild or moderate, but it is the, there is no forward bend of the penile curvature. And there is means that it is, there is no caldi and it can be done in single stage. That is, the, we use the uh, tissues of the baby's organ uh, to create a, create a new tube. That is called a new tube is created up using the baby's uh, surrounding tissues. In second stage, uh, in, in two stages means it is done for severe hypospedias along with the forward bend uh, in the penile curvature. In stage one what we do is we uh, release the bend completely straighten the penis and we create a bed uh, on the penile surface so that in future we create a tube. That is the second that is future in the sense the second stage. In second stage what we do is we create a tube, nice tube using the bed what we created in the first stage and then we place a catheter, uh, that urinary catheter or a urinary tube for the urine to pass and there will be a dressing. And and, and then sometimes the dressing, uh, they'll be there and uh, it could be either in the diaper we put the catheter tube or we can attach it to the uh, urinary bag. So that this will be there for at least 10 days. After 10 days we remove it and the baby will be passing urine freely in the, from the tip of the uh, uh, penile, uh, penile organ. And uh, <clears throat> usually, the, in, in very rarely the penile organ could be very small. In some unique, very rare cases, so it's very small, we call it as micro penis. In such cases, we cannot do an immediate repair, cannot be done, though the age is appropriate. That time what we do is a hormonal stimulation is given. That is either in form of injection or in form of a cream is applied to the penile surface so that we get adequate length of the penis and then we do the repair. That why is the, uh, the reason being is that we get good results after hormonal stimulation in such cases. And and one, one advice is that the hypospedias should be done by persons who are regularly operating on hypospedias and who are really experienced in hypospedias surgery because the results are very good in such, uh, in, in such hands. And uh, worldwide accepted results being 90 to 95%. That is the worldwide accepted result. Thank you.